Okay. Oh, God, I don't, I don't know what's wrong with it. I don't know. I did a test stream earlier and it was working just fine. I don't know. I don't know what's wrong with it. I hate the fact that it's not working. Like, like it doesn't work when I need it to. Like, it only works when it feels like it. Please, for the love of God, just work. Like, come on. Man, like I said, like it, it only works when it feels like it. Only works when it feels like it. It's pissing me off. Like it's, it's pissing me off so bad. Like it really is. Like I don't know. I don't know what to do.
you know, and I got, you know, this computer was supposed to be better than my laptop that I was using, but no, it's not. It's, it's worse, actually. The laptop that took, like, freaking five minutes just a little web page. See, like, it keep, like, it goes from the red square to the yellow square to the orange, then green, and then it goes back to red. Okay, now, with any luck, and I mean luck, we can have a good time, and everything will be okay. No, fucking stop. Okay, like on all my streams, I'm gonna meet my mic when a cutscene or when an important scene happens, and then the game will be, uh, you'll hear the game at max volume. So, yeah, there's one coming up right now. I could talk to you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about everything. I wish I could just talk to someone. It's all falling apart here. I can't believe what's happening. It's strange. Such a little thing. How many times you watched that thing? Guess you really miss her. Don't worry, we're almost there. You'll be able to look her up once we're on board. Sounds like you do have a lot of catching up to do. All right, everyone, we're here. It's sinking our orbit now. All this trouble over that chunk of rock. Deep space mining is a lucrative business, Ms. Daniels. Each is seven is a gold mine, according to prospectors' reports. Cobalt, silicon, osmium. Now, where is she? There she is. We have visual contact. So that's Ishimura. Impressive. The USG Ishimura. Biggest planet cracker in her class. And it looks like they already popped the cork. Why is it all dark? I don't see any running lights. Corporal, take us in closer and hail them. And stay clear of that debris field. We're here to fix their ship, not the other way around. 
USG Ishimura, this is the emergency maintenance team of the USG Kellyan responding to your distress call. Come in, Ishimura. You're gonna need to boost the signal if their power's low. Yes, we know. Boost the signal. More. Never heard of a total communications blackout on one of these things. You'd think with a thousand people on board, someone would pick up the phone. What is that? It's a busted array like we thought. Sounds like they're having problems with their encoder. You get us down there and Isaac and I can fix it. 48 hours max. All right, you have the lady. Take us in, let's see what needs fixing. Gravity tether's engaged. Automatic docking procedures are go. What the hell? Sir, the auto dock. What is it? We're off track. We're gonna hit the hole. Hit the blast shields. That guidance tether's damaged. Switch to manual, now. Inside the magnetic field? Are you insane? Abort! No! We can make it inside. Corporal, I gave you an order. Uh, the field's too strong. Everyone okay? What? What the hell were you thinking? Were you trying to get us killed? I just saved our asses, Miss Daniels. If we had aborted at that speed and distance, we'd have smashed right into the side of the Ishimura. Now settle down, let's get to work. Corporal, report. I'm not getting any readings from the port booster, and we've lost comms and autopilot. It'll take some time to fix. All right, let's get some extra hands from Flight Deck to help out. Hold still, Isaac. I'm syncing up everyone's rig with the ship. Okay, we're done. Clean bill of health for everyone. All right. We've still got a job to do. We're moving out. Okay. And we're here. And we're in. Thank you, whatever your name is. Welcome, CEC employee, to the USG Ishimura. You didn't lose power to the port booster. You lost the port booster. Unbelievable. Get over here and hack the door pad. Thank you. <laughs> I know how to operate door. Jesus. Don't tell me what to do. Seems like everyone was trying to pack in a hurry. Guess there should be a security detail in here. Yeah? Well, there's not. There's nobody here. I can't pick up any broadcasts. Well, that security console is still live. Isaac, log in and see what you can find. Kendra, get that elevator back online. Power's dead. I can't. Then we root the damn power. Look, if we all cooperate, we can figure this out a lot sooner. Let's get that computer display up, Isaac. Use the notation system to find your next objective. Just like that? Okay. Huh, that doesn't look good. She's taking a lot of damage. The trans system's offline. Getting around's gonna be difficult. Air seems to be flowing again, that's a start. What the hell was that? Automatic quarantine must have tripped when the filtration system restarted. Everybody relax. What was that? Did you hear that? Not sure. What the hell? I don't know, something's in the room with us. Jesus! Over fire! Over fire! Kendra, power! Kendra! 
Come on. Come on. Got it. Isaac, get the hell out of there. The doors are locked. Run. No, I'm going as fast as I can, woman. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> and here is the baby, the best weapon of all. I'm not worried about that guy just yet. I need to get ammo. I should probably stop leaning. Oh, okay, hold on. This is Benson. Everybody, listen up. They're using the vents. That's how they're getting around the ship. Stay away from you. Get back. Get back. Audio logs, man. <laughs> Isaac! 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 <laughs> we ran to more of them on the way over here. Are you okay? More what? What the hell are those things? Is that the crew? Keep your voice down. Whatever they are, they're not friendly, and half the doors on this ship are locked because of the quarantine. Now, we have to get to the bridge, but first, we gotta repair the tram system. You're crazy, Hammond. You're gonna get us all killed. If you listen to me, I will get you out of here alive. Now, what's wrong with the tram? The data board is fried, but there should be a spare in the maintenance bay. There's also a broken tram blocking the tunnel that needs to be repaired. Damn it! Everything is on the other side of this quarantine. We can't reach it from here. No, we can't. But you can. Isaac, if I can get to the bridge, I should be able to access the personnel files. You fix the tram, and I'll help you find Nicole. Here's the map. Okay. So we need a data board for that. You need a data board for that. Okay, we're gonna see what's in these lockers. Just the ammo and stuff. Okay, we don't know what's gonna happen. Half the time, anyway. Doesn't mean it's any less creepy. Isaac, be careful. Shooting them in the body didn't seem to work. Go for the limb. Dismember them. That should do the job.
stasis module. Three sixty spin, and then we can move. I'm going to go ahead and save. Okay. God, this game is creepy. This game is... This game makes you really... really scared to go in the bathrooms for some reason. Like... When we get the computer online, you'll be able to call the tram from the control room. Faster the better. I can hear something crawling around out there. Got another audio log. Listen up, car eight is trashed. We managed to get it back to the repair depot, but now the auto loader is fried. I need a stasis module brought down here now. If we don't get this piece of shit off the tracks, it's gonna jam up the whole system. Come on down, Leaper. Fucking assholes. God, they're so ugly. 
so ugly and disgusting, but shit. The fuck out of here. Like, really? <laughs> Like, I'm surprised that scared anybody. Oh, we got another audio blog. This is Benson, Tram Engineering. We think we I think you out. still need to find the data board to the Tram computer. It's in the maintenance bay. Or just interrupt it. Okay, can I, like, replay it? Apparently not, because Kendrick's wanted to be a bitch and just interrupted. Okay. Mm. Oh, Kendra. I guess I don't worry about that. God, the screams they do is so loud. What, what, what? Oh, Jesus. They're so loud and just gross. God. Ugh, God, they're... I gotta... I gotta turn it down, because it's... Like, it's not getting to me, it's just loud. It's just loud, that's why it's scaring me. Okay, you can quit being a red box of death now.
They don't miss, but that is a Clark. <laughs> Text law. Let's see what this says. USG Shimura Aerospace Engineering Department Shower Repairs Invoice Mission Day 2. Pull up the, pull the cord. Okay, I don't think reading the text log would be a good idea. Because it could easily get me killed. I mean, I'm not playing on, like, hardcore or anything, but, I mean, still don't want to take the, the chances, you know? Okay, so since the plasma cutter is literally the only weapon we're going to be using throughout this entire game, uh, might as well upgrade its damage. I can't upgrade its damage anymore. Okay, uh, reload? No, I gotta upgrade its, its damage and capacity. I played it as damage and capacity, so uh, like in this game, max plasma cutter is like the best thing in the world. Like, the world. It acted like it acted like like they weren't supposed to be there yet. Like we weren't like I wasn't supposed to see them walking, that's why it did no damage. I can't wait till we get to Dead Space 3, because I'm going to be playing through all of the games. And uh, Dead Space 3 just has like so many options of what you can do with the guns, and you don't need... Well, well, you don't need the plasma cutter for this game, but the plasma cutter is like... It's the best weapon in the first two games, and really... In the first two games, you don't need any other weapon besides the plasma. <laughs> Jesus. Right in the middle of when I was saying something, too. God damn it. I gotta see that again. <laughs> okay. Mother fucker. Okay. What I was saying was, before I was so rudely interrupted, was that uh, in the first two games you don't need the plasma cutter because it's so... It, it's so powerful. And in the second game you upgrade it all the way. Like you upgrade it to its max. It does fire damage among just being like a one-shot kill weapon on normal necromorphs. Like on normal necromorphs, the maxed out 
Plasma Cutter in Dead Space 2 did like one shot kills. She's a, she's kind of a bitch, isn't she? Like a major one. Okay, now we can go to the tram station and uh, go to the tram station. I don't trust it. I don't trust it. Yeah, we go to the tram station. And we can, like, access the store. Hopefully. Well, we've been live for uh, almost an hour already. Literally, like, 30 minutes of this freaking stream was me getting was me getting all set up because it just wouldn't work right I'm hoping that I'm not gonna have any more problems out of it where are you going dude like come on stop being a little girl Why worry about that when I can just do it with this one? Ha! Huh, you're funny! Oh no, I'm out of plasma cutter shots. Well, I mean, that's kind of what I get for wasting ammo. Look, Hammond. Fuck you, Kendra. Nope. I'm gonna pay attention to it and I'm gonna turn around and gonna open fire. That's how you take care of Necromorphs and Isaac Clark's town. Is there anything here? No. Nope. How unlucky you gotta be for that to happen to you. If only that AI knew what was going on.
Oh, ooh, headshotted it right in the air. Yeah, the med lab is like the worst place in this game. <laughs> I hate the med lab. It's my least favorite part in the game. Not for the fact that it's boring or anything, but for like, I don't know why, but the med lab just scares the shit out of me the most. Probably because it's a doctor's office. And you see a lot of like messed up stuff. What's in here? I never went this way. Oh, it's just a, another bathroom. Great. What? I just got goosebumps. I just heard a ghost, and I didn't like that. Like, I didn't know that was, I don't know, that was, like, things you could hear. Like, already, Isaac's crazy, and he's only been on this ship for, like, 30 minutes. This is what I get for playing this game at 3.30 in the goddamn morning. <clears throat> or no, 2.30 two, two in the morning. Close enough. Alright. Level 2 suit. We can get a level 2 suit. Okay. We're gonna... Okay, so since... God, the small med packs are so expensive. Why? Okay. We're gonna get... A little too suit. Just because it would be good for us. A little too suit is going to help us out because of the upgraded armor that it gives us. Now it actually looks like I is a classic suit. Now, for Dead Space 2, um, more than likely what's going to be doing with Dead Space 2 and 3 is that I'm going to be playing on New Game Plus so I can get access to other stuff. That's just what I'm planning on doing. I'm going to get, a, get a small, one small med pack and one small med pack and, oh, and more ammo. Because, <sighs> uh, I mean, Let's see how many one hit point. <laughs> Let me see here. Like you would need let's see. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, 
14, 15. You need 15 nodes in order to fully upgrade this. That's stupid. Where's this? Is there like a. Well, no, I guess it saves for you every time you get on the tram, doesn't it? Is there anything in here that I need to see? No, there's not. Okay. Alright. We're gonna go. Chapter 1 New Arrivals Complete. <sighs> okay. Save your progress. Yes, I want you to save my progress. This would be a lot better if I was talking to somebody. Like, it wouldn't be scary. <laughs> Alright, so this is what's going to happen. I'm going to call it a night, because I'm like really tired, and I should have started a lot earlier. I know, well, we need to, well, I guess we can watch this. Okay. Alright. Uh, okay. We'll we'll do we'll do one more chapter. We'll do chapter two and then we'll uh we'll move on and then I'll end the stream. Okay, um okay, so I can't access anything in the store because I already did that. <laughs> Thank you. I knew this already. Flamethrower. It's one of the shittiest weapons in this game. Yes, sir. Okay. Is there anything here that we can collect? 3,000 credits. That's not bad. Uh, I guess we'll save. Why not? Right. <laughs> Why not? Okay. Right. 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 It's telling me to go this way, but my mind wants me to go this way. What new exciting dangers will lurk around me at every corner from now on? Because I'm being a complete idiot right now. What the fuck is that? Oh, that's that guy that's banging his head on the wall. Nope. <laughs> no, if I was Isaac, I'd be like, okay, we need to get out of here. What was that? What was that? Give me the option. Give me the option to pick something up. What is that?
I know I'm not crazy. I heard like where you can pick something up. Going to the med lab. Nope, not today. <laughs> not today. Good. These problems are somehow connected to the marker. You can assume all you want to. I do not. <laughs> The marker is glorious and divine. You... you know that. God moves in mysterious ways. Anyway, we'll have it on board tomorrow. You can analyze it all you want to. What are you so worried about? Worried? Captain, people are dying down there, killing each other. Is this madness the transformation unitology teaches us? Doctor. Terence. There will always be risk when the stakes are high. And here... They're enormous. It could change everything. And that's what worries me. <laughs> hmm. 
Okay then. I I haven't I have never seen that one. I haven't seen that video log yet. Join us in paradise. No, thank you. I don't want to be turned into a giant slimy monster alien thing. Full of ammo, huh? Well, shit. <sighs> Me full of ammo is stupid. It shouldn't be a thing. Biological Prosthetic Center. We keep you working. I'm sure you do. See, I said the med lad, you see a lot of fucked up shit, and I wasn't lying. <laughs> I honestly didn't know Isaac was going to do that, because usually when it's a human... Usually when it's a human that he's approaching, he doesn't, uh, he just points his gun down. God, he's just got more balls than any body I've ever seen in my life. He kicks the aliens. He doesn't shoot them all the time. He kicks them. Ty. <laughs> <laughs> Kick him again. Boom. <laughs> Look, it's the pregnancy. Really? You couldn't be a brute. Because that's totally not what I'm assuming that it is. There's a female necromorph. <laughs> one of my favorite things to do is to get one of their severed claws and impale them with it. It's one of my favorite things to do. 
But unfortunately, we're in the, the I guess the hub world. So the red bone. Damn it. So that's why we gotta go that way. Let's go to the store real quick. See what we are up and see what we can do. Flamethrower. You know, I don't know. I never tried the flamethrower. I don't know if it's any good or not. But I'm not going to try it. Because I just don't care enough to. Cool. Just buy more med packs. Because ammo for the plasma cutter is actually pretty, pretty damn common. Because, you know... They gotta give the most powerful weapon in the game really cheap ammo. Surprise he's not gone yet. Probably because his probably because his brain's like damaged. My brain's gonna get damaged from playing this goddamn game. <laughs> that way, the next note I get, I can upgrade the reload. Because why not? <laughs> okay. <sighs> God, it's so weird. Wow, well, I don't need those. I thought that was gonna be something interesting, like you know, like a like another weapon. But no, it's line racks and for the line gun. It's just a shitty version of the plasma cutter. Jesus, no. think so. <laughs> Vacuum. But space is a vacuum. <laughs> okay, there's a power node out here somewhere. I know there is. Can't lie to me. Tell me that there isn't. Yay.
<laughs> it's a candlestick. <laughs> All right. Oh God, I hate these things. They freaking killed me. Alright, we're going to check out the store real quick. Alright, I've got nothing really. We don't have the resources to deal with this many cases. Nobody would tell us what's happening. These wounds, we are not equipped to deal with this. God. Get up to the table. Hold him. Nurse, you hold him down. Every quarter. In Isaac's mind. <laughs>
again, ooh. My name is Eileen Fisk. I just woke up in here and everybody was gone. I don't know what's happening. Why did they all leave? I'm going to try and find someone. If you can hear this, please come for me. I can hear scratching in the wall. Hello? Who's there? Are, are you a doctor? Why is everyone... Wait, I know you. You're Harris, the prisoner from the colony. You killed that nurse. Help! Somebody help me! Please! Please! <laughs> Game so messed up. You know, no wonder I is so crazy. Everybody kills themselves in front of him. I mean, hell, if I saw that shit, I'd go crazy too. concern me greatly. I have no doubt they are somehow linked to the discovery of the marker, but the exact nature of that connection is still unknown. Almost 40% of the colonists are experiencing a form of dementia. The obvious symptoms are acute depression, insomnia, and hallucination. Incidents of violence and even murder also indicate extreme paranoia. Dr. Mercer has advised that I bring some of the affected on board for study. Dr. Wellen, the planet-side psychiatrist, has reported that his own analysis has been fruitless. I'm hesitant to rely on Dr. Mercer at this point, but I need his expertise. We need solutions, and we need them quickly. Can I get the power node from here? Oh, no, the range isn't that long. Hey, they're pretty. Fine. I'll actually go over there and go get it. Well, that's probably why, because there's glass there.
Oh god, I just realized that the the necromorph that we just killed was the captain. I just now I just now realized that. I just now realized that. God, I'm an idiot. And that was supposed to be like the boss for the second chapter. <laughs> Because it was like you find out how the necromorphs are made. There's like a. You know, the man. He was hard to take down. I mean, I guess it was kind of like a boss battle. One of them found a way down to the captain's nest. I managed to contain it in a damaged escape pod. Lifting executive lockdown now. I found the deck logs. Whatever is happening around here, it came from the planet when they cracked it open. It spread to the colony and reached the ship. Isaac, this isn't an infection. It's some form of alien life. <laughs> Shit, we've got bigger problems. The ship's engines are offline and our orbit is decaying. Get over to the engineering deck ASAP while I stay here and figure out what the problem is. And we come back full circle. Yes, save thy progress. Alright, so since we did chapter 1 and 2 for tonight, I'm going to end this stream, and uh, I'll try tomorrow to pick it up. And we're working on borrowed time here. First, there's no fuel in the engines. Second, the gravity centrifuge is offline, which means there's a couple of trillion tons of rock pulling us down. I need you to get that centrifuge operational. Refuel the main engine and fire it up so I can stabilize the ship's orbit. Okay. We're not doing that right now. Because we gotta wait for the next stream. So uh, I'm gonna wait until probably tomorrow to keep uh, streaming. But I hope you guys enjoyed the stream. Uh, come back tomorrow if anybody ever watched this stream. Uh, and I will speak with you guys again soon. See you later.